My name is Garrett Stevens, and you're watching Elk TV. <laughs> Time. First, Sonic the Hedgehog. If you were disappointed in his design, <laughs> yeah, his design was straight trash. Dude, he had human teeth. Yeah, he should never have human teeth. Well, point is, the developers have promised that they will change his design. Hopefully, they'll change it to a better design. It looks like a little rat. <laughs> it looked disgusting. I, I saw that. But hey, if the movie's trash, Jim Carrey will carry it. <laughs> That's really bad. All right, um, next. Oh, the Far From Home trailer dropped over this past week, and it looks good. Like, I'm ready for the next Spider-Man. Um, but if you have not seen Endgame, do not watch the trailer. It has some spoilers. There are major spoilers within the first, like, 30 seconds of the trailer. Yeah. It's school news. Hey, I was going to say that. Stay in your lane. <laughs> and now on to school news. May 23rd, Thursday, May 23rd, from 4 to 8, head down to Bahama Bucks, and they're doing a fundraiser for the cheerleader. What are you doing? I was making the icy, you know, the icy. Oh, like the flavor? Yeah. I got you, I got you, I got you. <laughs> It's a fundraiser for the cheerleaders, so from 4 to 8 p.m. to 8 p.m. at Bahama Bucks. Just show up, buy some snow cones, hang out with your cheerleaders. That'll be fun. I also hope everyone did well on their ELC and AP test that's been going on these past week. That and was exhausting. Which day I had history. That's about it. <laughs> really? Yeah. Okay, well, I had um, Tuesday, we did the the AP test for physics, and then we had the EOC on Wednesday for A push or just US history. Today, we had the AP test for A push. And that's. I feel so sorry for you. I'm so tired. <laughs> <laughs> all right, that's all for Elk News. I'm Aiden. And I'm Grayson. And uh, you want to. Yeah, out? and this has been. Out. This has been out <laughs> My name is Braxton Mouse, and you're watching on TV. I am Brigham Loveland. I'm a superstar. Mm. Aiden? I... What are you doing? What? Nothing. What's poppin' up, Nation? I'm Samuel. I'm in. And you're watching Elk Sports. It's 
school sports, our boys varsity baseball team won their playoff series against South Hills with two blowout wins and zero and 14 and two. Then for softball, our Lady Elks sadly lost in their second round of the playoffs to Bothell, with losing both games 7 to nothing and 2 to Last week and for the first time ever in Kentucky Derby history, the winner Maximum Security was disqualified. Writer Jockey Pratt claimed that Maximum Security got out of his lane in the final turn, which caused him to lose his spot. That's all for sports, I'm Aiden. I'm Samuel. And this has been Oak Sports. <laughs>
Um, a pencil. <laughs> No. <laughs> um. Right hand. I don't know. That's hard. I'm your left hand. I can hold. You can't hold your left hand by your left hand. This belongs to you, but everyone else uses it. What is it? Your card. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, My time. Um. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Jesus is your name to talk to. You know. Okay, but I can use my own name. Oh, well, you yeah. That's but everyone like else can use it too. Right now. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Oh wait. <laughs> hey, when I was six, my sister was half my age. Now I'm seventy-two. How old is she now? 69. No. Yeah. I give up. I cannot. Wait, when I was six, sister was half my age. So she was 30. Now you're 72. 75. Oh, I thought you said 72. <laughs> okay, 72. Yes. That took like 10 minutes. Um, you better give someone else that one. Get away. Go away. This is ours. Go away. Stop filming. Stop filming right now. It's over. Stop. Stop the recording. Stop the recording. Stop. Oh my God. give your youngsters a lot of pleasure with Kool-Aid. You know it's pure and good. It has the Parents Magazine seal. And it's so thrifty. A five-cent package makes two full quarts. Just add Kool-Aid to water with ice. Add some sugar and stir. For the very best drink you ever made. Be sure that the envelope says Kool-Aid. We're going to ask people their weirdest insults. Let's go. What is your weirdest insult? Um, I was called uh, a not so spicy pepperoni. And how do you feel about that? It makes me very angry. What is your weirdest insult? Um, you look like a midget. <laughs> Why? Okay, what is your weirdest insult? You're gay. Oh, I don't know. Hmm. That's a great <laughs> you look insult. Like you were drawn by my I'm left just... hand. <laughs> yes. You're a circle and I'm a polygon. <gasps> <laughs> What is your weirdest insult? That I look like one of the dogs from the movie 101 Dalmatians. But you're red. But I have freckles. Oh, yeah. Red Dalmatian. Ah. <laughs> what is your weirdest insult? What? <laughs> your weirdest insult. That's a good insult. I feel very insulted right now. What is your weirdest insult? Um, I call people a walnut. I have called people walnuts. It's really weird. You're a walnut. I know. What is your weirdest insult? Um, one time my friend Maddie called me Polly Pocket because I'm so short. Okay. 
<laughs> what is your weirdest insult? I have no soul. Wait, like that we tell to other people? To other people or to me? Either. Um, I call people chicken nuggets. I think that's a compliment. Those Ew. are delicious treats <laughs> for all ages. Are they McDonald's chicken nuggets or Chick-fil-A chicken nuggets? No, they're Wendy's chicken nuggets. Whoa. <laughs> that's Whoa. disgusting. <laughs> exactly. Um, to other people, I call people kids, but I'm calling them baby goats, not children. Oh. So you <laughs> eat trash. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> We're recording. Okay. So, oh, start off by saying your name, person last, and you're watching LTV. It was the Disney. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. um, I'm Kelsey Thompson, and you're watching LTV. <laughs> <laughs> You're still here? What are you doing here? You're still here. It's over. The movie's over. It's over. Go home. Go home. Go home. Go. 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 <laughs>